Okay, hi, welcome, welcome back to season two, ow, episode two of The Walking Dead. We had a choice last time whether to, wait, was I on the right season? Wait, I'm confused. Season two. There we go. I think I'm also, I'm gonna be playing on controller, but I'm just gonna turn it down again a bit more. Just cause this game is quite a bit louder. I'm excited. Last time we had to choose between Pete or Nick and I chose Nick because Pete was already bitten. So there's like Loki 0. Oh, okay. There we go. Previously on The Walking Dead. There we go. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington, then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. I... Where's the rest of your group? Uh, Learn that Krista's... I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm not coming back. Um... I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since oh my you're God, this pretty much on your own, hey. what's your plan? Maybe I could stay here for a little bit, if that's all right. I've got no problem with it. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. There we go. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you. No. Just say he was already bit. You could have saved him. Babes, that was not saving you just him. Leave him. He was already bit. What do you want me to do? My guilt is your guilt. Your guilt is not my fault. But yeah, I was talking about it with my friend, um, cause she's played it before. And she mentioned that Christmas just never comes back. I don't know how I feel about that. Are you really playing the silent game right now? I'm sorry about Pete. I'm literally a child. How are you mad at me? Why'd you leave my uncle? Because he was already bit. Back at the stream. Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. You actually can't be mad at me for that. What do we do now? I don't care. Oh, if we're stuck here. We should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. How is the child making all the responsible decisions? Gosh. <laughs> it's a still. I know what it is. The fuck you do. Okay, what then? It's for making booze. That rig ain't fit to piss in. Gosh, this is gonna be painful. What is that stuff? Let me see. No. Yeah. 
Whiskey. Now what? Oh, fuck if I know. We wait, I guess. Shortly after the time of the walkers... Wait, I didn't search the crate! Clementine! Surely they would just, like, disperse. Fine, it's just him being an idiot. Stop it. You're scaring me. I had to kill my mom. Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. Everyone I, I grew that. up with, it all happened to them. Now, it's gonna happen to us. B bro. We're all so fucked. We'll make it. Bullshit. I mean, what's the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Eventually, it'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? Looks like it's just been a hey, few kid. hours. It's the night. Have a drink with me. No thanks. She is a child. I will not be endorsing that behavior. Listen, they're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What, what are you going to do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. They're good people. Better than me. I knew someone like you. He was always screwing up too. Screwing up? Ben! I didn't ask for any of this. Nobody does. But so what? Come with me. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. They're family. Nick, I need your help. Please. You're right. Yeah. So can he just stay here? Now look, if we get separated, the cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. In what direction? You ready? You can't just say that and not give me like a general direction. North, west, east, south. Fuck it. Done that so discreetly, hey, quietly. Over here. Come on, you fucks! Look at me! Get the fuck out of here! I said, get the fuck out of here! I don't want to leave him. 
They are so slow. They are literally so slow. He could have just run for it as well. Why is he trying to be a savior? Y'all need to stop being saviors. Ooh, a house divided. Wait, they're not gonna like me now. Because I come back without Pete and without Nick. <laughs> Jesus. Clementine, are you all right? Barely. Snow with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walker. Who's Alvin? My God. Oh, Where they searched for Where us. Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. Unless I'm missing something, he was really badly sheltering Sarah, which is only going to end up for the worse. Like, let's be honest. When it has being sheltered ever been good for a game? I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. It's so cool. <laughs> take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? He'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes, Clementine, yes. I just need to... Do you want to see what I found? Oh, okay. Not a gun. Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? As long as you don't tell your dad. I won't, I promise. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? Um, I don't know. I thought it'd be heavier. Okay. Probably is with What bullets. do I do? The most important thing is, when you go to shoot, take a breath before you pull the trigger. <sighs> Not that big. <sighs> What should I shoot? Don't do that! S -s -s sorry Sorry! Maybe I could practice outside. No. There's that tree. Hey, Luke's back! She recited what Lee taught her. Oh my god. Okay, I can't explore. It's fine. Oh, I have my hammer still. I don't like what's going on. Hello. That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. 
where? Hello? Uh, Clem, I can't uh, breathe. I can't, I can't breathe. Shh. She's gonna have a panic attack. Oh my god. Hello? Hello. How are you? Okay. How are you? Well, I'm doing just fine. Thank you. My He's giving David I vibes. Way down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? I'm Carly. Carly. That's a sweet name. You mind if I come in? Carly? I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. No, I guess not. If I push him out, he's going to want to come in. It's a nice place. If Is I let him in. Around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. Just me and, and dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. <laughs> Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Oh my god. Is the front door shut? They have a really bad habit of leaving the doors open. It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. There's yeah, no water. Well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through, or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Hell, I just got here, and I already don't want to leave. Just passing through, going north. Whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. And I can't stand that Yankee weather. Have I should have mentioned north? the Krista, but... Well, not since before. <sighs> but I've heard things. I want to divert the conversation. Where does this go? Uh, in the drawer there. <gasps> Well, it's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. Ah, just leave. I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. What's his name? Carlos. I shouldn't have said that. I can't stress her out. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? Oh my god. I thought you said nobody's here. I didn't hear anything. Be under the bed. Actually, I feel like that's a very common place to hide. But she is. Okay. <laughs> I'll let it go. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. 
Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Sure. <laughs> Who's this? Well, it's a kid. Yeah. Looks like it was taken in this room. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? From what I've said, I could just be like, oh, I don't know, maybe they would fool me. I haven't been here that long. I'm just passing well, through. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. You know? But wait, who are you? He's Carver. You a real good day now. I think. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Max, I don't know. <laughs> what did she, what did she want me to say? Oh yeah. We'll deal with we it. Need to find I don't know how. We can't go outside. Clementine. Sarah. You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm I didn't really down, have a chance. Linda. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. I did, did ask he his, say name, his though. name. I didn't ask his name. I did. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? How old was he? He had a mustache. Like mine, or more like Alvin's? Um, it was droopy. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy. Nicest? Not nice. Right? Debatable. You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? <gasps> oh! Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. Oh no. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Can I be Clementine filled in here? surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. Why did you leave his camp? Because we had to. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. Godlid. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, You'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Watch out, his eyes not there anymore. <laughs> uh... Now you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem, sorry if I gave you some shit back there. 
I'm just a little on edge. You are a grown it's adult a with a baby. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. Why is Carver after you? After me? Oh, you mean us. It's a long story. He... He has a hard time living. He up. might be the baby's father. I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. That reaction Sometimes says it's it all. hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Yeah. Especially if you can't treat me right. I don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? There. That's where we were. Nick! I reckon he's fine. I think he's fine. He's fine. Jesus. <laughs> hey man, you got any aspirin? Nick, you asshole. Pete's dead. I know man, I do. We gotta get moving. Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. Hey, Clem. Uh, I just wanted to say, thanks for not giving up on me. Yeah. I'm not going to do it again. I'm sorry about Pete. Yeah. Thanks. What's up with you? What's up with them? What's up with everyone? What happened back there in that cellar? Did he do something stupid? Like he can tell me. Nick saved my life. Really? Yeah. Sort of. <laughs> I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? Look, <laughs> I know we got off to a rough start. And I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. I'm yeah, the child. I'm you guys. Why am I and looking up to him? Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Nick. Actually, why are you lagging behind? Ooh, a little time skip. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. There's a lift or Oh my god, this is a ski lodge. It must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Here, eat this Beck. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Last of us flashbacks. Uh... There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. This looks like Wyoming. Like, it could just be the whole ski lodge thing. 
that I'm thinking There's of. There's a little house by the bridge. The Last of Us, but how big is it? Wyoming it's vibes. Small. I used to call it Yoming. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. <laughs> Hold on now. Oh my god. Can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. Luke, you, you better not die. Up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other <laughs> She's side. Like, we'll have a tough time coming me? from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. I can do it. See? Why is it echoing no so badly? It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? <laughs> if something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Howard hey, Juro. Uh, Love them. Sorry about that. I just could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. They're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? You dare change the subject. What does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? I mean, safety. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. But family. You get safety with family. Anyways, Whether that's found. You, you can ask Rebecca. Or... Okay, I'm, I'm not going to get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. Take out that one, then that one. Hmm. Well, one at shoot each. Them. Too much noise. Let's take them. I like your style. Yeah. I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. I've got the big one. Hey, kid. Look, it's not like I don't know you have guts, but are you crazy? Maybe I am. <laughs> Just stick with the plan, okay? Ugh. Fine. Go ahead. Get a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Oh. <laughs> oh. Nice work, kid. Ow. Please have nothing bad happen to Luke. I would not be able to handle it. I actually wouldn't. I love him. Three. You can take on three. Yeah, three. Well, I'm okay. I just I'm stuck. Okay, he is impaled. I can't reach. It's okay. Clem, look, we'll figure something out. Behind you. Oh shit.
That was... No option came off. I don't get what's supposed to be happening. <laughs> right, I had to check what to do. Go for the legs. I would never have gotten that. Come on! What was the point of passing him the thing then? Thanks, Clem. Told you I can handle myself. Let's keep going. See him? Yeah. I mean, he's pretty hard to miss. <laughs> Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. I mean, you really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. What should I say? I don't know. Ask him for directions. <laughs> well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. We're a little lost. Lost, huh? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything. If you, you are. Know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. We're just people. Fair enough. You folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. You all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I gotta say... You two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, He's gonna get food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? No. No, 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 no. He's he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down. Oh, come on. Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? He was going to help us. How do you know? He's... Damn it, Nick. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. <sighs> oh, 
Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Because you were oh, aiming straight at him. Tell you, man, he drew first. Everybody calm down. What did you see, Clem? Is that guy going to shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't going to do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit Were you of having us. the conversation? Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't Don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? I don't know. I No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. Well, I can't. He did have a Wait bullet a to the neck. Fine. So Look, can I talk to you alone? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Bex dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. Why I, are you asking the youngest? Food in the station. The food. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. Sure. I can't. Thanks, Clem. Lazy, lazy people. Well, not so much Rebecca. But Alvin! Rebecca, are you okay? I'm all right. I just need a little rest. And some food. Alvin. I don't like Alvin. I'm sorry. I don't. He's annoying me. Why don't you go to it? You're the adult. I am the child. <laughs> Thanks a lot for backing me up there. I'm sorry, but if it's you or Luke, I'm going to Luke. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. Who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. He could have been anybody. Right. We don't know. How do we know he wasn't with Carver anyway? If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. Okay, well, I don't think I can go talk to them, so I'm gonna go check out the station. Oh, I feel really bad. The audio is very weird the man in this game said he had lots sometimes. of food. There's gotta be something left. I don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Hmm. Knife. Feels pretty good. <laughs> I guess he slept here. Yeah. Oh. Is that all that's in there? Oh. It's dead. Take it, we might find batteries. <gasps> or oh, we can use a knife. <laughs> Did he lie about having food? Man, not that we had a bed. Look at this dump. Guess he did have food. And fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, you ever known anyone to do a thing like that? 
Actually, yeah. What happened? A woman in our group. Her dad died, and then she just shot this other woman. Damn. What'd you do? My friend forgave her. Huh. And then she stole our car and left us. Oh. <laughs> I like how it brings it back up, though. That's funny. She looks just like you. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. Did you blame him, though? God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. The hell is that? Walkers. We got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. <gasps> Until dawn. Oh my god. And I said that Sarah looks like Hannah. Well. What are we waiting for? This is perfect. We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? That'd be just like climbing a treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Damn. Did keep you safe, though, you know. Gotta count your wins somewhere. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Thanks for the confidence. Really, you got a good grip. Really yeah. appreciate that. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Well, that sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. It's like the oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're you're fine. All right, just just slow down. Just for a second, okay? You just told me not to look. Good point. <laughs> oh gosh. The crow? Made it. You see anything? I can see the bridge. <gasps> wait, I see something. What is it? A light. W wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. You just left me up here by myself. Wait, no. Wait, because we had the little snippet. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Are you trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, whoa. Kitty? Whoa, whoa. Please, just do what he says. <laughs> Penny. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? Kitty. <gasps> <Getty. 
I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. And the music. Are you sure you don't mind? It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. I just remember this music vividly from episode one, season one, when you go in like the back room of the pharmacy with Lee and Clem. Oh. <laughs> Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. What's funny? Oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. I said he well, wasn't dead. Why better. don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You put that down. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? If you tell me they're good, then I'm... Us. Good. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. Nick! That is very hypocritical of you to say. Dad, look! A Christmas tree! Not now, Sarah. Isn't it great? We found it all in storage. It's amazing. <laughs> Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. I've missed Kenny. I've made, I've missed the character I know. Obviously, I know Clem, but I guess like a supporting character. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Hell. Oh, God. He was a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he took care of him. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well... That was such a stupid Krista dad. and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. I'm sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. Krista told me you were dead. I am. This is all a dream. Kenny. <laughs> sorry, bad joke. Krista got in a hell of a mess. I gave her a hand and then it got messier. For a minute there, it wasn't looking too good for old Kenny. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, 
This is my girl, Sarita. Aww. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course rooting he is. Rooting and tooting. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? <laughs> hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? What is it? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. See a teacher as well. It hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an adult. Mmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? What is this? Le Walter Surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. That it's peaches doesn't sound how bad. That's all we got. Huh. Striking resemblance. Anyway, I'll take it from here. <laughs> you can even let me have a taste. Damn. Fine. Reminds me of school. A nice version. Right? <laughs> What's this song you're humming? Good King I Wentz's seen last. one of these. It's my favorite Christmas song. What's it about? Well, it's about a king that brings food to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the man. The storm is very strong. After a long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go on. But the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. Mark my footsteps, scoot my page, tread thou in them boldly. Thou shalt find the winter's rage, freeze thy blood less coldly. I don't get it. <laughs> <laughs> it means that doing good things for people can be good for you too. But the servant wouldn't have been out there in the first place if the king hadn't made him. <laughs> Good point. Clem, we could use some help. Hey, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. So, how'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up? You should have seen his beard then. <laughs> Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Decorating is one of the best parts. Find a tree topper. Gotta do everything. Uh. Oh, I can look at that. Oh, hello. See, I know the map Luke had on the back of it, it said Virginia. But, uh, well, I guess that's still where they are. Oh god, the viewpoint in this game is so hard to deal with sometimes. Get- oh, fine. Can I- okay. Fine. I'm very confused on this viewpoint. Oh!
Hopefully I'm allowed the music on. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. Alvin Carlos are up there. Oh, I have to go up the st That makes sense. It's a tiny bit hard to see things. I wouldn't it's crazy. Mind. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? <laughs> Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? I saw lights. Which way did they go? I don't Back know. into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. He mentioned someone else. Someone else? Who? His friend. His name is Matthew. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. If it comes down to it, I'm choosing Kenny over you. Well, maybe not over Luke, but definitely over everyone else. <laughs> Oh, wait. Okay, wait. Let me... Can I back out? Oh, we can pick the star. Let's go with an angel then. Because Sarah mentioned the angel. She looks so cool. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. I feel no, like it'd be better if it was more diagonal. This place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Oh, I didn't get a chance to speak Honestly, to Rebecca. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. What does Matthew look like? Oh, he's a handsome man. A little shorter than Walter. He should be back soon. I have a feeling. Clem, I want to use Carver. Does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. I haven't noticed. Oh, well, let me know if you do. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman, but I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. I get it now. <laughs> Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Okay, I think I can go back upstairs and speak to her now. Okay, I can't look at anything. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean... How can anyone now? I think it's possible. How do you know? Well, I'm still here. You know what? Maybe she's not. Maybe she's not but pretty. at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. Wanna listen? That food smells good, huh? Can I? She's gonna <laughs> be a runner. It's not his. Well, how do you know? I just do. We were trying for so long and, and then... 
Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. Cheating is the worst. I don't think there's an excuse for it at all. It's... You okay, man? Yeah, I'm just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. No. No. I want to sit with Luke. I want to sit with Kenny. Oh, I don't know. I want to sit with Kenny. I want to sit with Luke. I'm hoping Kenny will understand. So what's the deal with your friend here? Yes, we were just talking about this Kenny. What do you make of him, Clem? I mean, he's right behind you. I trust him. With your life? I think so. Walter was telling me his family died. That's horrible. A thing like that can hit a guy pretty hard. He lost his whole family? He did the best he could. Oh, I want to go give him a I'm hug. Sure it was really hard on everyone. I bet. Kenny! Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's... it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> so, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. Why would you want to leave this place? You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? The hell is that? A place. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold-ass winter so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice. I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. Well, that'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long He's day. so angry. Please eat. Pass me that can, duck. Duck? Who's Duck? Leave him alone, Luke. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? <laughs> oh my god. I really feel for Kenny. But he's so uh, angry. I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher. And I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. But it didn't work out with Lily and Kenny and Lee. Listen, relationships sorry. are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? The two of us must unify our factions for the common good. You know, like Churchill and Roosevelt. They say the world say is anything. over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. P 
people are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? <laughs> well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. Partner is in. In any case, the point is, partner? as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? It's never that easy. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clint. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Why would Man, we not just know tell Kenny? I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. <gasps> Bonnie! Miss? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Walt, Damn, I don't know. Pretty just... You're just gonna let her in like yeah. that? Yeah. It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. Yeah. Sorry, I'm Bonnie, but like... Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. See, why is this so echoey? It's a bit weird. I have a little girl like you. How old are you, sweetie? I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. Is this before or after her 400 days story? How much are you giving her? Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. What is going on? Clementine, don't freak out. Listen, okay, I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I didn't even... I don't I think actually... Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. What if he finds out anyway? Uh... Well, then we're fucked. But, you know, we'll just... We'll just deal with it then. Now, do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, <gasps> well, go get rid of it. That's I'll why I showed it. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. Luke? Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. I know. It's it's nothing, really. Forget it. 
Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Come on, Nick, let's go find a beer or something. It's not always best to tell them the truth. That is what I've learned. At least, story purposes. Oh, no. It's gone. Is that why Kenny wanted to talk to Walter? Oh my god. Oh my god. How do we get out of this? Walter? I always liked this knife. WM. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier or something about shooting a man. I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then. But now? We didn't do anything. Where'd you get the knife then? Found it. We found it in the shack. Is, uh, is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. I swear, if he does anything he else after this, life. if he does... No. Oh, he was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's Nick, going on? going you back tell inside. Him. Tell him what? What happened on the bridge? We just lied. We just lied. Why? Why would we tell? Him? Why would you tell us this? Why? Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, 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 thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I, I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. I feel like he's going to die. What you've done to me? He you feels any idea? replaceable. I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Is that because we said he's a good guy? Walt, what's going on? The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. Know how to do this? Wait. I can do it. Okay, we'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. Am I missing something? How does she know? Oh. Let's get the key. Is 
something ain't right. Yeah. They're already here. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like the cabin don't would have be much ammunition. secure enough anyway. The They're behind us. You could easily beeline it to the lodge. Carlos. I feel like he's gonna live and his daughter's gonna die. Get the gun. Quick, 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 quick. Go with the knife. I not call that. Where's Rebecca? Carver. It's nice to see you too. That's oh. his baby. Yeah. I Sarah. Inside. Yeah, she needs to hide from them. I oh. Look at this place. I feel like they're gonna make me choose between, like, being with Kenny or being with Luke's group. I don't know what choose. Power and everything. A lot of windows though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? These stairs Johnny, are magical. Cover that window. They're not creaky at all.
Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh! Oh! Rebecca! Oh. Rebecca! Our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there. Oh. And Alvin, and Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice. And show your faces. My dad, please. He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back. The baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? How the hell am I supposed to know? They're still outside. They can help us. We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. We start shooting and people are gonna die on both sides. Ah! Yes! Clem can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is oh she Oh my doing? gosh! Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. This is all your fault! Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! <gasps> Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. Ah! I don't want to make the choice. I don't want to make the choice. I don't know. Oh, gosh. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. Say goodbye, Carlos. Don't look, Susie. Don't look. Dad! He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. I'm sorry, but you have to stop running. Bill, stop! Ah. 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 You all right? Fuck you, Bill. I can't tell if she wanted you don't to cheat. Want to or... Please let these people go. There was something else at play. Shut up. Oh. 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 Clem, can you reach my hands? Everything under control? Clem. I'll try. Mm. <gasps> Kenny! Don't move. I can't see him. Watch them. Man, now I didn't want to do this, but you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. <laughs> or you can give up now. Your choice. Hi, Alvin. You motherfucker. Alvin! Bill, no! Tell him to stop! You remember George, Alvin? You see, I do. What do you mean, Kenny? Stop. I remember stop. a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. And why? Because you didn't like me. You could have lodged a complaint. You could have. Well, you could have been civil. Bill, no. We'll do whatever you want. I love you, Beck. Bill, please. <laughs> We can do this all night. Is that what you want? Where's Luke? 
Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. Just take the shot. <laughs> All right, round them up. We're heading back to camp. Luke. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding? I don't know if we could have saved Walt, but I know one of us didn't just give up. Yeah, I know. The folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them, knowing full well those who choose not to accept our love. I surely wish that they had. The storm is Fifty-one percent of players blame someone else. So you and thirty-five point eight percent of players start with Luke. Forty-four percent of players then tell Walter the truth. You and fifty-six percent of players convince Walter to forgive Nick. Okay. You and fifty-six percent of players stay to help Carlos. Yeah, I kind of. I just want to sit with Luke. Okay. I love Luke. I want to sit with him. But that is it for episode two of The Walking Dead. It definitely leaves you with so much suspense, which I like. I don't know. I think season one, it was rarely ever left on a cliffhanger. I think maybe episode four was the only one that was left on a cliffhanger. They had the next time on, but it wasn't ever left on a cliffhanger whereas has this kind of been for the past two episodes i don't know but i really like the way it's been done and i really like the length and the pacing of it i really hope it continues to have this basically because i just i'm really really enjoying it but i am going to go ahead and leave that there for today's episode next time will be episode three and then two more and then we're done with episode season two. Oh my god i feel like i'm getting through it so quickly but i am enjoying it so so much i'm gonna leave that there for today though thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed and hopefully i'll see you in the next part of the walking dead okay bye